Okay, I'm reloaded. We got London on the Tell me, do you know the feel? Tell me, do you know the feel? You look up and you ain't got no feel. Oh, me in a Lambo? Nah. Hey, what's up guys, it's Omi in the Hellcat and today we're gonna go pay my guys. One second. Get over here! Now you're gonna meet Reloaded Constructions again. Now, the first video was last week. Now I'm gonna get into daily vlogging, so let's go. I'm actually on my way back down to Philly right now. Go meet up with my security and my construction team real quick. Um, they're finishing the project on Philly 21. Now, I want to talk a little bit about people's self-entitlement. People feel as though they deserve more than what they deserve. And if you have those kind of people around you, then those are the type of people that you don't want around you. Like when people feel as though that they deserve what you got because they've been around a little bit or and, and that's not the way life goes, you know? People have to wake up and work for their own shit. And you know, when people sit around and just wait for your lead, it's like, it's, it's, it's kind of like putting pressure on you. So you got those kind of people around you, you know, little by little, just start, you know, taking yourself away. It's not that you don't fuck with them or love them. It's just that, you know, it's your turn to shine. You know, I, I know this girl who used to like, you know, put everything, put everyone before her. Now she's finally happy. She's finally like with somebody, and she's finally moved on. But for a lot of period, of, like a, a long time in her life, all she did was cater to other people. She knows who she is. She catered to a lot of other people. Her sister, her brother died young, you know, and then she catered to a lot of people. And I always should tell her like, why? And she said she used to always tell me because that's the right thing to do. And I just think it's wrong. You only get one life, you know. If, you trying to fix everybody else's problems. What the fuck are you going to get out of life? You know what I mean? So, yeah, in, in a sense, you need to start worrying about yourself and worry about, you know, your life. Your life comes before anybody else's. You got to make yourself happy before you can make anybody else happy. And that comes whether it's friendship, relationship, partnership, business partnership, anything in life. Make sure that you're happy internally before you can make somebody else happy. Listen, I got this gun on my hand. And this symbolizes, you know, uh, when I was, you know, ready to commit suicide. And I put this gun on my hand to, to tell myself, like, you know, you will never go through this shit again. And this is the last gun you will ever point at your head. So that, that's what that symbolizes. You know what I mean? Just because people are more famous than you, just because people are making more money than you, doesn't mean they're better than you. At the end of the day, we're all flesh and blood. You know what I mean? And it doesn't really matter. You know, I see a lot of people get treated bad because of other people feel as though they're higher, they're higher priority, they're higher standard, and it doesn't work that fucking way. You know, just because you got a little bit more money, a little bit more fame than somebody, doesn't mean that you're a better person than them. Because you can have all the money in the world and still be a piece of shit. And I know a couple of them, trust me. Okay, guys, so we're here at Philly 21. Oh, look at that. Look, look. Man, he's nah, he ain't never like him. How does it feel that you're responsible for shooting a man's penis off? Tatted it on my hand. <laughs> oh shit, you did tat it on your hand. Look. Why this shit look so old? It just happened. Hmm? It was like two years ago. Yeah, but why the hell? He shot, he, shot, he shot a man's penis off. Look at this guy. I'm out, Playboy. You out today? Yeah. What's wrong? What's wrong? Like, like you said, what's going on? Talk to My me. My girl just broke up with me, man. Why? Because I worked too much for you, nigga. 
Yo, P. We, we all know you're rich too. You just like to work. <laughs> He got it working now, huh? Yo, he's, the, he's the richest Asian that works. He loves I work. can never have enough money, nigga. I'm trying to reach your level. My nigga. And every time you see him, he's eating. Got you, bro. <laughs> look, 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 look. There goes, there goes Mr. Miyagi. Look, look, that's Mr. That's Mr. Miyagi. And that's Daniel's son. Look, 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 look. You hear him? Tone, tone's the... Listen, Tone's the best to, to ever do it. The only reason why we learn in LED, the only reason why we learn all this light work, the reason why all my shit looks fire, and I learned the lights, is because of that guy. So, that's why we're the best. This little guy looks... I know, right? You, you look sad today. What's going on? Home. Why you look so sad today? I told you my girl broke up with me, man. She'll never leave you. <laughs> you got the two inches of pain. Yeah, nigga. I'm a bit bigger than yours, nigga. You know what? Just barely, and the, the sad part is that I'm fat. Hey, we're up here. Now. Look at my nephew acting like he's working. <laughs> Why are you hiding from me? <laughs> Look, Macha's cheap. He went and bought some TCLs instead of Vizios. But you know what? For what we're doing, we can't put no uh, Samsung TVs up. These are 200 bucks. I should have never said that. But now somebody breaks my TV, they're gonna try paying twenty dollars. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's on sale. Sale's over. Oh, sale's over. Sale's over. Today. So if somebody breaks your TV, they might not get a chance to make it out without getting fucked up. My beard looks warm. Yeah. When you see those suds up top, that means it's warm. You ain't lying because it is tasting a little. Come on, you think? Sure. You optimistic? You think we're gonna be ready to open the time? No, no. Whatever it takes, man. You gotta make it happen. The 18 is on. That's it. The 18. Mm hmm. B, B, B team is home right now. They're, uh, <laughs> they're still recuperating, breaking stuff down. Gotta get the B team some work soon. You know what? No kid, the supervisor here? Look who showed up today to work. You see this now? Dang. Energy drink, bazooka. I'm already plugged in your shit. Oh, look at this nigga. 1998 fucking Bluetooth headphone. Yo, that joint like a dinosaur, bro. How you doing, brother? Chilling, chilling. You allowed to put this on there? Well, yeah. Uh -huh. What? I'm just fucking with you. <laughs> Are you allowed to even be on this joint? Is your wife gonna allow you? No. Now if you're doing some crazy shit. We young Latin entrepreneurs. Bazooka energy drink. It tastes like um, Red Bull, but it doesn't have the aftertaste. Good promo. You like that? No, it's real shit. I actually enjoy it. For people who, who like the aftertaste, will just stick the Red Bull. But if they don't want the aftertaste, then Bazooka's dope. People always gonna fuck with, like... And, and quick thing. I was talking to the guy who owns uh, Philly Extract. And he said that if you have Red Bull on tap, that's not really Red Bull you're getting, period. It's, it's a generic. So Red Bull makes so much money off of their cans, there's no way that they'll even make it on tap. So if you like that t shit, like from clubs and, and taps, for that, you'd rather just drink bazooka because it tastes better than that shit. I swear to God. Man, I think you owe me a free sticker or something. Yeah, yeah. I, just, I just came from God bless you, brother. Thank you, thank Allah bless you. Allah bless you. Yo, how, how, how do Muslims say, uh, God, they say God bless you too? No, I say I'm not Oh, I don't know that. All right, I'm gonna create you your account then. Yo, can we show that? Can you show me that Reloaded Riders thing real quick? Yeah, I want you. I want you guys to uh, tell me what you guys think about this. About this. Uh, oh, like, like he was working on my. No, you a kiss ass. You had you just put that on there just maybe you feel no, special. No, no, nigga, look. I was working on all your shit today. I need that one redone. Like a, like a, like more 3D ish. This? You yeah. want this to be 3D? Like a 3D, yeah, like a 3D-ish drum. It looks a little like, it looks like a pog. You know, back in the days we played pogs? 
So you young kids don't know nothing about Pogs. Remember Pogs? The metal jaws, and you flip them jaws over, and you get to keep your Pogs. They need to do shit yeah, like that's that. Old shit. That's what I said. Yeah, <laughs> both Pogs was the that's shit, old bro. Shit. I used to go to uh, Wordsworth Academy. Uh, that's pretty dope. Go to 21. Go to templates, though, bitch. You ain't fooling me. After Effect templates. The first one was better. No, show me the, the other thing. Reloaded. The, re the Reloaded Riders. You look at this job. See, I want to start signing like dirt bike guys. And you know, it's just it really is a clothing clothing brand, and I'll I'll just you know sign a few guys, and they get percentage of the merch. Look at this, boom! I need this in the PNG. Send it to me. Ring. Look, that's actually fucking Boogie. That's the logo. He's the Jerry West. Jerry West is the NBA logo, right? That's why I asked really for his for his, for his uh, Instagram. So I can put it. It's M M M Boogie. Ming 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 Ming. There's Ming 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 and there's Brad 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 Brad. I got him already. Ming 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 Ming. Yo, what time is it? Is it too late to go to New York? Oh yeah, it's too late. You know what? Best Buy run. Best Buy run real quick. Yo, so no kid is the construction supervisor now? Huh? He he he's the onset supervisor. Yo, I've never seen this man drink a beer in my life. I'm so listen, surprised, bro. It's a hard week, bro. That's my idea. It's a hard week, man. Listen, I deserve it. Hell yeah. I like beer, man. He got Henny if you want some Henny. I got a half a gallon in that. Yo, he, he was, he's not allowed to drink I'm with me, bro. Yeah. My nigga, I'm going to show you my phone. Did I'm talking about butt naked. <laughs> butt naked, my nigga. He said, dude, he died in poop. Yeah. <laughs> he's not allowed to drink with me no more, ever. Damn. Ever. Bro, you know what it is? Mixing pure white Henny with regular Henny? Plus, it was two bottles of Henny. Not one. Two bottles. Be real. Jordan, we're gonna go to uh, <laughs> we're gonna go to Not Best Buy. Best Buy. Yeah. We out. All right, Best Buy. Got a haircut, yo. <laughs> Look at this drum. <laughs> no, it looked like he went to the fucking <laughs> to the Chinese store. Yo, bro. <laughs> Fresh out the shop. Where you going? Hmm? Fresh out the shop. What hmm. shop you go to? Plug them in so we know. I ain't been in the bar so we know shop we, in two weeks. I about to say, plug them in so we know we're not to go there. <laughs> actually, cut in the garage. That's fucked up. <laughs> Even worse. Who is it? My man, Papo. <laughs> he said, my man, Papo. Yo. Yo. Yeah. Nigga, get no more cuts. Nigga, this nigga look like. What? Man. He look like he did. 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 He look like he I, I keep my shit straight, right, man. Right, right, right. I'm out of here. I'm going Best Buy. Fuck y'all. We out. Said that already. I know, man. You gotta, you gotta go. <laughs> what you doing, man? Oh, that's the Mavic 2 Pro. What's that the zoom? I don't know, but I want that. That thing is dope. I got this. So this is what I want to get. That right there. That's called the DJI Pocket Go. That shit is dope as fuck. I want that Osmo right there. I had one of those. What? The Osmos. What is it? The, the, the jump and go. That's how that's to hold the phone? Yeah, it's to the phone. So they, they actually hold the uh, the new DJI GoPros too. Huh? Yeah. Get y'all sexy. TV. I like this song. Lollipop. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. The Osmo Pocket. Let's see how this works. I ain't got no freaking nails. See the word I use freaking, not effing? Yeah, man. 
Tastes good. Ooh, I like penetrating. <laughs> I like this song. Lollipops. I like that song. But I never heard that. <laughs> <laughs> I just made that up. <laughs> no mom is going. No mom is. Oh, the queen, no mommies, no mommies, queen. Yo, this thing is the size of my. <laughs> Yo, this is tiny. Oh, what the? What the? No illusion. Right. Oh, what's that? I don't know. They got Chinese letters on here. Like, like I know how to read Chinese. One One what is this for? I don't know. Oh, the car goes in the air at least. Oh, this is probably for a future adapter or something. Possibly. Right. Maybe some kind of like tripod. I'm gonna cut the power on him, see. Well, that thing just went retarded on me. Uh oh. Oh, look, it was on Chinese letters. It was touch screen. That thing is incredible. Oh, look at the V roll. Yeah, that shit is tiny. Device not activated. So how do I activate this device? Let me get this real quick. Yo, this thing is like uh, say so trying to find daddy. Oh my god, look at this. This thing is tiny. Make tiny. Oh crap! That's all the compass. Oh, oh look at this! Where you? That's where that thing goes. It connects to your iPhone. To activate it. Lolly bumps. Oh DJ I likes when I insert it. Alright. So Yo, this thing is tiny. That's what she says. Damn, I didn't finish the fucking vlog. Get over here! But anyway, guys, um, I didn't get a chance to finish my vlog. Um, I had a lot of issues today. I filmed a lot of funny stuff. It was like really genuine, and I felt as though like it was so genuine that I couldn't go back and re-record it. So you know, the mic wasn't working and. I didn't have a gimbal, but yeah, guys, you know, I'm going to get better within time, but this has actually been a great three days, um, filming, editing, and, man, I'm having a great time, you, you have no idea, this is so therapeutic for me, and you guys are going to see more and more time comes, I'm going to open up more and more about my personal life, and, you know, why you don't see my kids running around right now, and, you know, all, all within time, all within time. But I want to thank you guys for uh, following me on my journey tomorrow. We finish it off with another vlog. Thanks for everything, guys. Peace out. Tell me, do you know the feeling? Looking up, I see no stunning. Looking down, I see dripping. Neck work for half a million. Niggas mad because I'm living. On Instagram, trying to kill him. But I'm too busy fucking bad bitches getting M's, nigga. I'm chilling. Twin size, had to sleep on it. New crib, drop three on it. Hit the club and just keep going. See, I'm going to stop, but I keep throwing. If you fuck me.